Eric, I can't imagine the stress you go through as a manager watching an end-to-end -end game like that. How do you sum this up now that you're here and you've come away with a point after going 3-1 up in the game? Yeah, <laughs> we're winning and then we're losing. Uh, we should have uh, take three points, <laughs> clear. And but there's also uh, in more games, uh, home against Galatasaray, away in Copenhagen. Um, we play so good, uh, so I have to make big compliment to the team. But also in the same moment, I have to criticize the team and us uh, as a coaching staff, me as a manager. Uh, we are defending not good enough. Uh, we are leading 3-1, then you can't afford such mistake we're making because that yeah, makes a difference. What area of the pitch do you think you're losing control in the games that ends up causing you to lose these leads that you're taking in matches? Yeah, it, we knew that. I think uh, every goal has its own story. And uh, the first is a transition moment where we spoke about quick release and we don't um, block the middle. Uh, the second is a free kick, unnecessary free kick, but then we have to defend the free kick better. And then the third one, we are very good in, uh, in organise, uh, but we got run off and, yeah, uh, and we are uh, in, in an overload there. So it can never happen that our mistakes uh, can't be in the Champions League, you get punished for it, so we have to learn from that. It must be really frustrating for you as a manager as well, because as a team you're scoring so many goals, particularly in the Champions League, but you just keep conceding. So how do you go about fixing that problem? Uh, we will fix that. But uh, So I'm very pleased. Uh, you see the style of this team, uh, proactive, uh, dynamic, brave. Uh, so that's what I said. I was really pleased with the performance. Uh, we created so many chances. Also in the end, uh, we could have won this game. I think with Scott and with Pelle in the end, uh, big chances. Um, and it was not about luck, but playing about good football. If Manchester United go out of the Champions League and it's down to throwing away leads in games, who is there to blame for that? Yeah, it's always me and I'm responsible for this. Um, but also, no, we are in the project and uh, we're getting forward, we're making improvement. So that's very hopeful and we are in the right direction. And so I know where we have to go, which steps we have to take. And I'm sure we will be successful in the long term. Uh, but yeah, if you want to stay in the Champions League, we have to win the next game. Thanks, Eric. You're welcome.